Richo. Hello, John. Worst Christmas present? Uh, worst Christmas present. I actually received a flask when I was 12 years old. Yeah. <laughs> I know. What would you like for Christmas, mate? What would I like for Christmas? Oh, my God. I want some seagulls wins. That's what I want, but from the other side, mate, I've got everything. I've got everything. I'm a grateful man. I've got everything. You're a humble man. I'm a <laughs> New Year's resolution? Um, I think, yeah, just try and be more happy. More be more happy. Yeah, just uh, enjoy life more and get out and about and do it with a smile on your face. Really, Richard, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, John. Cheers, mate. Thank you. <laughs> Have you never got a bad Christmas present? No. I guess everyone puts time and thought into things for me, John. Really? Yeah, to be honest. Uh, not not usual. I'm not pretty not pretty used to that, to be honest. But um, worst Chris worst Christmas present I would say back back in the day, Mum got me a um, a clock that was battery operated, so it very rarely told the correct time. <laughs> Were you always late for stuff? I was always late, always late. Well, would you like for Christmas, mate? Don't take batteries for that clock. I'm, I'm very lucky, I'm a very um, minimal type of man, mate. I just find, my girlfriend finds it very hard to, to find things for me. Um, very simple, so I'm obviously okay with like KFC vouchers and things like that. <laughs> and yeah. I, no word of a lie. Yeah, I know you. <laughs> New Year's resolution? Um, probably maybe try to get a bit fitter, hence why I'm at cricket at the moment. Um, I'm shaped like a, an overweight pear at the moment. Skinny fat, I think they call it. Would I be right saying that's been your New Year's resolution for the last 17 years? Yeah, yeah, I think so. No, when I was younger, metabolism was my friend. Now it's not the same, mate. It doesn't work like it used to. It's a bad energy. Yeah, I know, right? Ridiculous. Merry Christmas, Lutzi. You too, mate. Good to see you again.